This is a quiet thief in the night that relentlessly robs from the patient the sense of identity, personality, and ultimately, the very essence of self. It's like having a sliver of your brain shaved every day. It took out family members. Now Alzheimer's has come for me. As a journalist, I put a stake in the ground and said, we're going to start to talk about it. We need what you have and what you do because I've never met or talked to anyone like you. He's making it possible for people to look at this disease long enough to do something about it. Otherwise, people just look away. I don't want anyone's pity. I'm trying to explain it in ways that people might understand it so they might better understand a loved one or friend who's going through it. You are this exceptionally unique individual who can share with the rest of the world what you and all of the other people are going through. And it makes you so valuable to us. I see myself as a window, not a martyr, because otherwise I don't want to do this. This is a guy who makes everyone around him feel great, despite the fact he doesn't feel so great. And that cannot be easy. That's a level of emotional, and I would say even spiritual resilience that is really inspirational and a model for us all.